Back in August of this year, before the start of the regular NFL season, Aaron Rodgers was asked if he was vaccinated. Rodgers responded with, yeah, I've been immunized. At that time, vaccination status was the talk of the town throughout the media when it came to NFL players. Due to the newly restructured COVID protocols and testing requirements announced by the NFL and NFLPA for the 2021 season. And many found Rogers' statement about immunization to be vague, in turn, that created speculation which surrounded Rogers and his vaccination status. Which this leads us into our topic of discussion for today. As many NFL fans know, Aaron Rodgers will not play on Sunday against the Kansas City Chiefs due to testing positive for COVID-19. And now Aaron is defending his initial immunization statement and believes he is in the crosshairs of what he described as the woke mob. Aaron Rodgers appeared on the Pat McAfee show as he normally does every week and discussed the decisions that he made towards his immunity. He told McAfee, I realize I'm in the crosshairs of the woke mob right now, so before my final nail gets put in my cancel culture casket, I think I'd like to set the record straight on some of the blatant lies that are out there about myself right now. It wasn't some sort of ruse or lie, it was the truth. Aaron speaking there about what he had said earlier in the year, he continues and adds, I believe strongly in bodily autonomy and the ability to make choices for your body. Not to have to acquiesce to some woke culture or crazed group of individuals who say you have to do something. Health is not a one-size-fits-all for everybody. My desire to immunize myself was what was best for my body, and that's why this is so important to me. I made a decision that was in my best interest for my body. I'm not telling somebody to get vaccinated or not get vaccinated. I'm not an anti-vax flat earther. I have an allergy to an ingredient that's in the mRNA vaccines. I found a long-term immunization protocol to protect myself, and I'm very proud of the research that went into that. Rogers also indicated that he has followed all NFL protocols to a T, except for wearing a mask during a news conference. Rogers also consulted with Joe Rogan, who provided his thoughts on the best way to create immunity against the virus. Rogers is just looking for respect into his choice. Guys, we would love to know your thoughts on this down below in the comments, but that will be it for today's video. If you are new here to CountryCast, remember to hit the subscribe button down below. Turn those notifications on as well, so you never miss out on any breaking updates surrounding your favorite country artist and all the news coming right out of Music City. Y'all stay country.